Congrats on graduating. Congratulations on graduating. Congratulations on graduating. Congrats on graduating. Congrats on graduating. Congrats on graduating. Congratulations on graduating. Hey Alex, it's your Acolittle. Honestly, back during last spring, you really intimidated me just because of like how confident you are and I was just like, Gah. that's too much confidence for me. But then like Beach Week happened and like Midsummer's happened and then this whole year happened with like all the Akka shenanigans and I think I just got into really appreciate your attitude towards life. It's really, I think it's really laid back and it's really like I don't give a fuck about other people's opinions kind of thing and that's like pretty darn admirable to me. You have like a personality that really like fills up the entire room and is like really infectious to basically anyone you talk to. You're a very charismatic person and Congratulations on making it through four years of college. I can't wait to see you at, in Seattle when you like when you move over here for the summer. Uh, I can't wait to see what you do next. And I hope to see you and make more memories in the future just because I hope to move to Seattle too sometime and it'll be a fun time. Bye Alex, for now. Hi Alice. Congrats on graduating. Feels just like yesterday we were both in STAT 2120, stressing over <laughs> exams. Uh, I've always looked up to you and all the help you've given me these past few years have really meant a lot to me, especially with the ICE project. Um, it was really fun to do Modern Fan with you this year and I know you'll do great things in post-grad life. Once again, congratulations. Congratulations, Amy! Uh, congratulations on graduating, Amy! Um, I remember first year, you were like one of the large, like you always drove me to all the sporting events, um, so I got to know you there. Uh, I also remember going to all the comm dinners with you and swiping you in, so that really got me out. That was like the main reason I went to comm dinners. Thank you for getting a good job with HVC. We got some points because you never left your apartment! <laughs> um, um, and good luck with med school. Hi Amy, I think I met you my first year. You were one of the first pers first people that I met um, and you gave me a car ride to one of the sporting events and I just remember that car ride being really fun. I got to know you a little bit and you were so nice to me and so welcoming. I just want to say good luck on wherever you're going. Um, definitely come back to visit us. Hi Amy, thank you for running sports my first year. It was also a big part of my first year. Um, and I had a lot of great memories then. Um, I played a lot of sports with my friends and you guys, and I really enjoyed my time. Thank you. Thank you for running sports. <laughs> Hi, you're Amy. Hello, my lineage. Um, <laughs> uh, so sad to see that you're leaving. Um, thank you so much for uh, being, uh, always being so nice. I remember first year going to Frisbee, actually the only sport I did like with. <laughs> but um, thank you for always encouraging, like bringing the good energy, encouraging people to play, bringing people out, giving people a ride. And uh, most, most importantly, thank you so much for asking me to apply for sports chair. You really made me uh, get closer to CSA as a whole. And I really appreciate that. So thank you so much, Amy. I'm so glad I got to know you better this year, especially during partner dance with, I don't know what I would have done if you, Emily, and Jaden weren't there because whew, the guys had trouble dancing sometimes, but it was a lot of fun with you guys. And I really depended on you. Like, I don't know if you knew this, but during practice, I would only look at you in the mirror and I would just depend on you. So hopefully that was able to fly but i'm so glad you were able to dance with us and get to bond a little bit during practices and good luck in your future i know you'll do great things and bye hi andrew aka our former webmaster congrats on graduating thank you for everything that you've done for csa and Thank you for always just being so welcoming and inviting whenever we're over at your apartment. And I remember like one of the first times that I met you, I was over and you offered high chews because you saw me eyeing them down on your coffee table and I was really craving high chews. So I really appreciate you offering them. Like earlier when you offered wings, which is literally your dinner, but I appreciate you so much and I appreciate like all your kind acts. But yeah, I just want to say thank you, and you're so big brain for graduating, honestly, like, CS2, 
everybody's emphasizing the CS and CSA, I guess. But yeah, I wish you the best of luck in whatever you choose to do in your future. You know, you'll do great and yeah. <laughs> Congratulations, Andrew! Thank you for showing me a picture of your bad hair. <laughs> uh, hi, Andrew. Uh, I remember the first day meeting you at like the CSA bonfire thing. We just talked uh, talked for a really long time about like computers and stuff. So that was really cool. And pretty much, I'm, I I've seen you at every single CSA event, pretty much, which is really awesome. And the amount of dances you took up on your own, it's so crazy for China Fest. So thank you so much for doing that. We're really gonna miss you. Have a bright future ahead of you. Really glad I could meet you this year. Hi Andrew, I'm so glad you joined CSA this year and it's been great hanging out with you and um, thanks for making me laugh and also sometimes scaring me <laughs> but um, it's been a really great year and we're gonna miss you so much. Hi Andrew, I'm so glad that I got to meet you this year and also the conversations that we've had also are so memorable to me. I'm so glad that I was able to talk to you during like China Fest, but also at other hangout meetings or like mixers. I hope you have a great time um, after college and come back and visit soon. Come visit! Bye! Andy, I'm a little confused by even making this video when you're still gonna be here another year coming to every single CSA event, right? Right? And I'm gonna make sure Calm puts us in the same family so I can force you to come to everything. Um, and if you don't come to CSA events, I'm not taking us out to eat ever. My car is of no use to you unless you come to meet the parents and all the fall family week stuff. And yeah, I'll still be hanging out with you next year, hopefully. So come text me, find me all the time. And peace, good luck at grad school. Hi, Bon. Bon. Um, my other King co-director. That's my co-director. Thank you so much for just, uh, well, being a great co-director and um, you are a, like my third academics dad or something. Thank you for being so uh, supportive and welcoming to the team. Um, all of um, you guys are just so incredible and the atmosphere in academics is amazing. I'm really glad that I got to dance with you this year. Um, you're so cool, so good at dancing. Also, actually, really incredibly good at freestyling and ciphering. Like, oh my god! So have fun in Seattle without us. Uh, love you. Congratulations, Brenda. Hi, Brenda. <laughs> Thanks for being our great, our great adjective on <laughs> in our first year. I had a really good time meeting you and I remember that time where we went to, I think it was KFT and then we also went to get lunch but I felt like I was able to chat with you and like talk with you and get to know you a little bit better um, and also that one time playing cook, uh, cook overcooked? Overcooked. <laughs> but I had a really good time and I'm so glad that I met you my first year. Um, you're also a PR queen. Um, you're so good at it, and I just hope that you have a great time outside of college, and definitely come back and visit. Hi Brenda, congratulations on graduating. Um, I remember one of my first times meeting you was when you were making jello shots, and I was like, wow, she's so creative. <laughs> um, um, I love seeing your different hair colors too. Um, uh, come back and visit us, we'll miss you a lot. Do great things. Um, hey Christy, uh, I know we didn't really talk that much this year, but um, I thought you were really cool and smart. I wish we could have talked more, but I wish you the best at UPenn and congratulations again. Congrats on graduating, Christy. You've always been really caring since ever since we were little, and you've always taken really good care of me. So thanks for always like making me food and taking me places. I'll be sad that we won't be able to spend another year together at school and have more fun, but I know that you'll have lots of fun at UPenn, and um, when you become like the nation's top dentist, please give me free dental cleanings, okay? <laughs> Hi Christy, you're seriously one of the coolest and smartest people I know and I really admire you and your work ethic um, and also you're a really good driver. Thank you for driving me places. 
Um, thank you for always being so patient and willing to give good advice um, and also for introducing me to some really cool music. Congratulations on graduating. I know you're going to be the best dentist ever. You're going to have so much fun in dental school. Wish you all the best. Yeah, congrats! Well, well, well. If it isn't my biggest nemesis in the entire earth, Cliff Lynn, you're graduating. That's really crazy because up until yesterday, I actually thought you were a third year. I'm gonna miss having your weird, strange, violent, murder, menace energy around in my life. You know, it's gonna be weird not feeling like I'm gonna die all the time, you know? Anyways, um, thank you for everything you've done, Cliff. You um, helped me make new friends. You uh, invited me out to fun events. You. What else did you do? Oh, oh my god, how could I forget? You invented the ladder system which helps me every day, and I would actually die without the ladder system. Cliff, I'm, what am I gonna do without you next year without the ladder system? I'm so screwed. Anyways, thanks for a lot of, a lot of that stuff. You should stay in touch. You should get better at texting. We talk to each other like once every two days. It's the dynamic. Anyways, keep in touch when you graduate, okay? Stop being so violent. Keep thriving. Keep being big brain. I hope to be as big brain as you. Hello, Mommy Daryl. Congratulations on graduating. I'll never forget the first game of Among Us that I played with you, um, where I asked everyone on the Discord call how to use the vents, or when Isabel and I scared you when you were alone in the Manatee Studying Voice channel. Um, and I just want to say thank you so much for being such an integral part of my first year. You were an amazing fam head, and I'm wishing you the best of luck in the future. I know you're going to do great things. Congratulations. Congratulations, David. David! Thanks for being such a great sports chair our first year. Um, I really appreciated the, like all the work you put into it. I did frisbee and black football, so I really enjoyed those. Thank you so much for being an amazing sports chair. I had a really good time our first year going to the sporting events, and I felt like you and uh, your coach were being there and like asking me to join and everything. It really got me out of my comfort uh, zone. What not? <laughs> and I felt like I was able to get into CSA some more. At all the sporting events, I always saw you there and like playing the sports, and I was like, oh my gosh, David's so athletic, and you're always just so nice to talk to, and you're such an amazing person. You're so cool. Hi, David. Thank you so much for running sports, and um, thank you so much for teaching us all the sports too. Um, couldn't have done it without you because. I only know how to play tennis, so <laughs> it was a big part of my first year, so um, thank you so much for all the great memories, and congrats on graduating. Hey David, thanks for being my lineage, thanks for uh, picking me, uh, I don't know, you, you picked me, but thanks for you know giving me the opportunity to ex uh, apply for sports chair, thanks for giving me all the pointers along the way, thanks for always being available whenever I need help planning sporting events, uh, or even just overall what to do, uh, any pointers, I know you always come by. I remember first year, um, you being the coach of Frisbee, um, you were extremely like super positive, no matter how many points we lost by, no matter how, how much we got beat down, you always like ended, uh, ended it with a smile, ended it with like, good job everyone, glad everyone who came out, and that just made me want to keep on coming out to more events. So that energy I really love. Thank you so much for making uh, CSA an approachable place. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Hi Edward, we're probably never going to go to the chiropractor or to get ice cream, even though we promised we would. But yeah, yeah. thanks for coming to our apartment and gossiping with us. And always par 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 participating <laughs> in said gossip, you even mean? though you didn't understand any of it. It's, over, it's, over. <laughs> it's fine. All I know about you, Edward, is that Megan goes to your place a lot to do laundry, and even though it looks like a paper box that's about to be blown away, apparently it's quite nice inside. Also, the only time I've ever seen you is also in conjunction with David, so, um... Cutest couple. Yeah. Even though I forgot to vote for you for that. I did. I forgot. For the record. Cutest couple. Bye-bye. Bye! -bye. Bye. <laughs> hey, Culture Grandma! Um, anyways, congratulations on graduating from UVA, Emily. We're actually getting our first and last lunch together tomorrow as undergrads, so I look forward to that. Looking at, back at our time together, 
Um, I feel like we only started talking this year actually um, because of culture stuff. Um, and having as my culture and lineage, I believe MG played a really big part um, in my time as a culture chair, considering I did come on board knowing actually nothing. I did not know when FMF was. I literally called it Fall Moon Festival for the longest time. I didn't know what China Fest was. So having you um, as the last old board to have an in-person China Fest, and just having your guys in general was just really helpful to me because I was definitely in a time of just panic and hope, like stressing if I was doing the right thing or not. But having you there to provide me guidance and reassuring me definitely helped me a lot throughout that time period. Um, and I am beyond thankful to be one of the culture chairs to organize your China, um, for your China Fest performance this year. I hope it was something memorable for you in a good way, and I hope that we made you proud as culture lineage. Hi Emily, I just wanted to congratulate you on finally graduating. Um, I just want to say that you are absolutely beautiful and so, so sweet. And the time that I got to spend with you through CSA, you know, especially last year at Danny's place on Mr. D, um, it was always such a fun time. And I just wish you the absolute best in your future endeavors. And I hope you come back and visit. Congratulations, Ethan! It was really nice meeting you first year during flag football. You and Tat really carried. You actually knew how to play football, so that was really helpful. Um, but thanks for that. <laughs> Hi, Ethan! Yes, thank you so much for carrying flag football, but also you're just so athletic in general. I just feel like it was really nice meeting you first year. And um, also, thank you for being so nice to me and chatting with me whenever there's like breaks in between. Um, I'm really glad that I got to meet you first year and I hope you all the best. Hi Ethan, thanks for teaching us um, everything about sports um, and being the carry in our team. Um, I was really bad at football, but football was really fun with you and Ted and everyone and all my friends, so it was really great and thank you so much. Hey Ethan, um, I remember this semester, or last semester, uh, flag football, you scored the very first touchdown. <laughs> I got so hyped, dude. I legitimately thought we would never ever score, but you made it happen. That was so crazy. So thank you so much for like bringing the energy, bringing the sportsmanship, and just bring your overall homun homunculus body to <laughs> you know our, our playing field and destroying the other team. Really appreciate it. Um, there's this really good shirtless picture of you playing volleyball uh, at the uh, AFC, the AFC website, the intramural website. So um, yeah, it's pretty solid. So uh, <laughs> thank you so much for always bringing the energy. Appreciate you. Bye. Chipmunks, uncle. Hi, Basil. I know we've never really got to talk, but I really wish we got to know I got to know you better because you just seem like such a cool person. I loved your yo-yo act so much. You were so talented. And my family, when we were coming out of China Fest, that was the one thing they said they would never forget. They were like, I will never forget Faisal's names because everyone was cheering Faisal on so loudly. So you were the most memorable part of China Fest, according to my family. So I hope you do great things in the future and good luck. Jennifer, okay. Tier one, tier one. I have way too much to say to you. Um, words can't describe how much I love you and how thankful I am to have had you in my life. I guess I can start off with um, saying thank you for the impact you've made on CSA. You are an absolutely amazing officer your second year. Working with you um, as secretary last year, like. I knew that I could always rely on you and you were just like the most amazing exec member and this year I really saw it oh my god I'm literally crying um I saw it um because you are my exec lineage and every time I needed guidance like you were there and I thought I literally call you the mother Teresa of CSA because of like how amazing for you and okay I'm not really like expressing my words well but not only do I want to thank you for everything you've done for CSA, I don't think this organization would be where it is without you, but for being like 
such an amazing friend like having you as a support and having someone who's always cheering me on and wants the best for me and is always there for me is like it's like such such a blessing and i hope you know that like if there's anyone out there that deserves the absolute world and the absolute best like that is all you and i'm sure anyone would agree with me um but yeah just i'm just gonna miss you so much you and sesame so i really hope that you come and visit so much and i just want to say I, I love you hi jason boomer lol stoner degen as you call yourself um but thank you so much for always checking in on me just at random points of the day like what for what reason but i always really appreciate it so thank you so much and for sending funny but mostly not funny memes but it's fine i really do appreciate that too um and for just always being there for me in general it's so nice to have like someone i can always reach out to whenever i have like questions about life or about other stuff oh well um but please keep in touch and i know you're going to do great things in the future so congratulations Hey Jason, uh, I'm so happy to be part of Chameleon's family with you as my uncle. Although you might have like some questionable sense of humor from the boomer type stuff, I still love you either way. I definitely appreciate the time that you took to like gather the ingredients when we make peanut noodles for that one for the picnic. And I also very appreciative of you like just talking to me throughout whether it's for I was when I was running for comm chair or just even like back in the beginning of the year when I first met you. I wish you a happy graduation and I hope I wish the best for you. Hey, hey Jenny. Jenny, congrats, congrats on graduating. You know, you're my older sister and I feel like I don't give you enough thanks, but thank you for always driving me to Kroger's these past two semesters. And, but like most importantly, just thank you for always being there for me. Like, you know, I went through a lot <laughs> since first year and like you were always someone I relied on there are just so many things I would talk to you with and you were always very supportive and like just always there and that was the most important part um you know I love you and we don't say that stuff so I'm gonna say it here <laughs> hey Jenny happy graduation super proud that you made it that far I know that I will be missing you a bunch it's gonna be super quiet I don't know who I'm going to get Starbucks with, but I know that there are many great things in store for you in life after college. UVA is going to be such a shitty place without you. Like, I don't know who I'm going to go to. When I just need to complain about someone or something or like who I want to get McDonald's with at like 11 p.m. Or who's going to get me cookout at 3 a.m. But you know what, I'll, I'll be able to manage and you'll still be hearing from me anyways. If not, like I'll probably just FaceTime you every day like we did your first year. I'll still be seeing you probably every weekend because you know I'll make the drive down because family is always what matters first. I love you. <laughs> Hi, Bessie. Congrats on graduating. Literally so mean for leaving us a year early but i know you'll do big things at google so it's all worth it thank you for everything that you've done for csa i know as former retired mr prez you did a lot of behind the scenes things that we didn't always get to see but i hope you know that we appreciate you and we'll miss you so so much literally gonna cry i already know it thank you so much and also just thank you for all the mums whether it be like KFT, Obor Tings, Elenium, Dragon Dance, always a good time. And thank you for always coming in clutch, especially with CS. I appreciate you so, so much. And I don't know how I would have gone through this class without you. And I know that like CSA wouldn't be the same without you either. But I know that you're gonna do such amazing things wherever you go. Um, I wish you the best of luck, literally best 2150 TA, worst coder, um, really emphasizing the CS in CSA, but yeah, we love you so much and we'll miss you so much, please come back to visit and we'll make sure to visit you in Cali as well, we'll see you soon. Hi Juice, um, 
I'm very glad that we had you as co-director this year, our father. Um, I'm really happy that I got to meet you and make a lot of good memories this year with academics. I'm really happy I got to dance with you. Um, you're incredible, you're so cool, um, especially your uh, special water <laughs> effects. Um, we'll miss you a lot. Um, you better come back and visit like every day next year, yeah. Hey Boston, um, even though our first encounter was kind of weird, I was just drunkly asking him to keep your dog after I stole him from your apartment. Uh, yeah, uh, you, I feel like he really made my four years here um, really fun and I've been really happy dancing with you on Akka and I'm really sad to see you go. But congratulations on graduating UVA and I hope the best for you um, in your future life and career um, aspirations. And come visit us often. Bye bye. Kazu, Kazunori Yoshizaki. Hi. I'm really glad to have gotten to know you a little better throughout this year. It's really interesting to just like learn some like small details about you, like how you're pretty light on Alk, or like how you're like a big softy, and like how you're just like really kind to a lot of people. I think it's, it's really nice, right? I'm really glad to have gotten to know you better like that. And it's great to see, have like danced with you throughout this year in academics. Congratulations on making it through four years of college, and good luck in like, SF. I can't wait to see what you do next. You better visit. If you don't visit, then you hate us. Got it? Cool. Bye, Kazu. Hi, Kim. Um, seriously, first of all, I just want to say thank you so much for being my lineage. I'm really grateful to have you as a point of contact, uh, especially for the future. I know I wasn't in Sam's film head, so I didn't really get the opportunity to meet you that much, but I'm just really grateful for your energy and your spontaneity. Honestly, doing being with you at the picnic and seeing you grab for the watermelon was one of the funnest times that I've ever had in a while, especially with the CSA fourth years. And I wish you well on your journey as you graduate college and I hope you can come visit CSA when we're next year. Hi, Megan. Oh, I can't believe you're leaving. You are such a good fam head and such a good outline for all future fam heads to follow. Like When I'm a fourth year, I want to be a fam head and emulate all the things that you did. You are so outgoing and kind and you can connect with anybody. Like I've never met someone who is not able to connect with you immediately because you are just such an outgoing person. And I just can't wait to see what you accomplish in the future. You are just so talented and capable and a systems queen. So you are gonna do great things and I'm gonna miss you so, so much. I can't imagine there not being a Megan fam head. Like this is going to be so weird next year, but I hope we'll hopefully fit your footsteps um, and yeah, good luck. Hey, Melissa. Congratulations on graduating and heading off from UVA. We really only started talking during China Fest season, which I am forever thankful for being the culture chair to organize your fourth year um, and for you being part of my modern fan dance. Um, I appreciate all the time and dedication you put into coming into practices and it was definitely scary for me because it was my first time teaching a choreography that was like, wasn't traditional. Um, along with me not knowing how to count, but I'm pretty sure that you're able to learn to dance and I am so proud of how well you did it and although you weren't able to perform with us on the actual stage, I really do hope we get to meet each other again in the future and perhaps record a video for it. Um, I definitely want to see that fan toss. <laughs> um, it was also really cool because when I was befriending people on Facebook to make the group chats for China Fest, seeing you um, used to work at the same place that I worked at high school, so seeing like Miss Anita and Miss Karen commenting on your post, I was like, she also worked at Open? So that's just having that connection with you, I feel like brought me closer to you. Although we didn't have that much time left, um, 
here uh, with our undergrad years together, I really do hope that we keep in contact in the future. And I know no matter where you go, that you're gonna excel wherever you are. So I look forward to see where you go next. Again, congratulations, and please don't be afraid to message me. Congratulations, Michelle. Um, thanks for being such an amazing aunt. I remember my first year, you were really welcoming. Um, you always encourage people to come out and you always had like a smile for everybody. And you always, I feel like, knew people by name, which is really nice too. Um, you're an amazing dancer. I am like so impressed that so, like how many dance groups in uh, KEDGE you're in. I'm really impressed. <laughs> Hello my fundraising lineage, thank you so much for teaching me everything about fundraising. You're absolutely a queen in that and you're just so strong and also dancing, you're so cool. <laughs> I hope to wish you the best luck in the future and I hope to see you again very soon. Hi Michelle, um, coming to UVA it was nice to see a familiar face and um, thank you for um, your dance, your first, the dance that you made your first year. Um, I remember that was like one of the reasons why I started getting into dancing um, and also um, audition for academics. So thank you so much for um, being so friendly and nice and being um, an upperclassman that I look up to a lot. Hi Michelle, congratulations. Um, I remember first year during China Fest. Uh, I think you were emceeing and you just had the driest humor in the world <laughs> and that was that was so funny to me for some reason but yeah thank you so much for making CSA an extremely enjoyable time <laughs> Hi Sam, congrats on graduating, woohoo you did it, yay, okay bye Okay, for everyone who isn't Sam, I'd like you to stay um, and I'd like to use this time to make a PSA about this guy um, so I've had the unfortunate pleasure of knowing him since childhood and it wasn't until college that I had a real conversation with him and I realized like this guy, this guy's weird, like he's crazy, he has psychopathic tendencies, you know like doctor he's out again, like he's crazy and he's violent, you know like that. Like one time we were TAing together in a lab and I was sitting minding my own business being the good person that I am and he leaned over and he was like, Kaylee, I'll be you up right here. And I was like, oh my god, what? Like, so scared, right? You know, also every time I get into his car, like, he threatens to shoot me with a Nerf gun. You know, I spend every every waking moment of my life just in fear, like, that we just let this, like, menace walk around grounds, like, just existing, like, unhinged, you know, so scared. Oh, and also he's tried to run me over, like, multiple times in my own driveway, which is offensive to me because one like you're trying to run me over and then two like you're trying to run me over in my own driveway like you shouldn't do that that's mean but yeah he tries to do it anyways i don't know i, I just wanted to say like to everyone congrats guys we suffered years of like sam tormenting us but he's finally graduating now so like that's one less psychopath on grounds so you know good job guys we did it congrats all right see you Congratulations, Sophia! Thank you for always drinking with me at parties. It was nice getting to know you. Um, also, thank you for taking care of me when I got really drunk that one time. Yeah. Thanks for being our historic, our first year too. All the good memes you captured. Yeah. Yes. You're so you're so good at photography. <laughs> Congrats. Congratulations. <laughs> Tiffany, oh my goodness, congratulations on graduating. I could go on and on and talk about all the memories we have, but I remember how I met you was not even through CSA, it was through our side class and I was late and I just so happened to sit next to you and then we ended up talking. We have so many memories together from doing FMF, to you being my first year modern China Fest dance, even though you were a second year. Um, and then you were my roommate last year and you continue to be one of my closest friends. And you know, you've made such a big impact on the people in CSA and on the organization as fundraising chair. And you know, I'm really, really gonna miss you, but you are so talented, so beautiful, and I know you're gonna do amazing things. So please come and visit if you're ever in Virginia again. And I love you. 
Hi William, I'm so glad we were on O board this past year together from the King's Dominion officer bonding trip to just the officer filming video for China Fest with the Chubby Bundy Challenge was so much fun. Um, I really liked getting to know you better during our time on O board and I honestly wish we met my first year so we could uh, get to know each other better. I admire all of your knowledge and skill about like the crazy thing like cars and music. I, I'm so jealous because I know absolutely nothing about cars and music. So um, yeah, keep at it and good luck. I can't remember if you ever decided between um, Google or Rivian, but whichever one you decided on, you got this. You know, I know you're gonna do great. You're so smart, so good luck. Congrats. Congrats! Bye bye! Bye bye! Congrats again, and I'll see you later.